This review is of a model of a vehicle made by the German company Doll. It's a short log carrier and it's made by Conrad. It comes in a typical Conrad box and it's very nicely packaged in foam rubber. But there's no information included either about the real truck or the model. The only assembly to do on the model is to fit the door mirrors and the roof aerials. The door mirrors you just uh, break them off the little plastic moulding and then they actually slot quite easily into place. The roof aerials are a different kettle of fish and they are quite uh, fiddly and difficult to fit. The truck is a Mercedes Actros and it's a typical Conrad uh, rendition. Very nicely made, uh, good decoration and there's a nice light bar and some air horns on the roof. You can see the wheel hubs look quite smart on the model. The vehicle is in the colours of Haman which is a German hauler of logs and you can see the cab decoration is is quite nice. Perhaps one detail that's missing is that there are no number plates on the vehicle but at the back you have this nice Epsilon grab which is uh, by Powerfinger and that's uh, really a nicely detailed item and here you can see that the operator seat is folded forward for when the vehicle is on the road. The overall look of the truck is really good particularly when it's loaded with the wooden logs that Conrad supplies. Let's now have a look underneath the truck. Um, most of the transmission components including the suspension at the rear is uh, made of plastic although the colour match is pretty good. The steering isn't realistically modelled but the functionality is very good. You can see what a hard lock you can get, you can get on that steering and uh, so it can pose really well. There's a degree of float in the rear axles, uh, I suppose to represent sus suspension, uh, nothing on the front. And the other feature is that the uh, cab does tilt forward uh, partially anyway um, and uh, you can see the engine uh, just underneath there. At the back is the power finger grab and it has good functionality so we'll start with the outriggers. These just pull out um, and rotate down and then you can pull the outrigger pads down. They're not, they're not screw pads, they just uh, they just pull out and you can do that on both sides. Now the outrigger arrangement is entirely in plastic so it's not um, as strong as metal and perhaps doesn't look quite as good as, as metal ones would but they're, they're okay for the model. You can fold out the uh, grab arm just like that and it's got a good range of uh, movement and there's the operator seat which can just be folded up for when he sits there and it's also got two telescopic stages which pull out and the grab at the end just rotates and the jaws can open quite nicely. We'll now have a look at the trailer so we'll take these logs off and these logs are real wood so they're, not, they're really quite nice little items to go with the model. The trailer is very simple. Um, you can see underneath the detail is basic. Um, the structure's nice, but uh, not too much in the way of detail. Suspension doesn't work or anything like that. Uh, but the draw bar and the steering axle works fine. So we'll just load the logs back up. You can connect the trailer to the truck, and when you do that, it all moves quite nicely. And if you like, you can practice trying to reverse the trailer. It's always a bit of a challenge. The other thing you can do if you like playing with a log or two is to practice your skills at loading the truck. So you can fit the logs into the grab and then by using all your skill you can carefully lift them up and swing them over to load them onto the vehicle. And you can clearly see what a terrific mess it is trying to do this. And if you've got no skill at all you'll be able to replicate this at home. And finally the logs land in the truck. Of course after practice uh, things become rather easier and you get quite good at it. And you can have many hours of fun loading the trucks at home. In summary Conrad have produced a nice looking model. It's uh, very well made as Conrad models usually are. And there's a good enough mix of detail and functionality to be able to highly recommend it.